Good morning. Who's laid off? Ew. The darker the better. Good morning, my amazing, beautiful, wonderful, fantastic friends. It's moving day. I had to end up hiring a moving company super last minute. Thank God I found someone. And they should be coming anywhere between 11 in the morning and 1 p.m. They're gonna help me pack all the stuff that I cannot fit in my car, and then I'm off. This is so exciting. Let's go, let's go. Unfortunate stuff. I'm not going to have internet for the first few days. I'm also not gonna have like a couch or my bed frames or my bar stools for a while. The couch and the bed frame won't come for another week. I don't know about the bar stools. I haven't gotten a word on the bar stools. That's good. That's great. That's basically where I'm at right now. One minute, 37 seconds later. My moving crew apparently just got, I'm so f***ing stressed. I want to like <laughs> jump off the balcony. I can't even, I'm sorry. The start of this video is gonna be a mess. Can't do this. <laughs> I'm not okay. Nothing is okay. I want to explode. Oh my God, I'm sweating. I'm like so gross. But I'm here. Do an empty apartment tour, even though, you know, I have all this stuff here. Um, so you walk in, and here's the kitchen with my toilet paper. That's nice. Uh, very nice, very nice. And then over here is the living area. And then I have this little balcony, which has like a wooded view, which is super nice. I like it. And then over here, I have, this is going to be my bedroom. So I plan to... You guys will see once I do all of it, but I have an idea of what I want to do for the bedroom. And then in here is the bathroom. I'm bleeding currently. And then this is the closet. And then we have Bomi eating away. Here is going to be the office. So this is where I'm going to be streaming. This is where I'm going to be working. It's going to be a lot of fun, which also has a bathroom. Hello. Here is going to be the other closet that's also going to have like the litter boxes and stuff in here. That's like the quick and dirty little apartment tour. I'm so freaking stressed and tired and just sweaty and gross. It's going great. So this is, this is the veggies and tofu. And then this is just vegetables with rice noodles that I don't believe I ordered. Y'all are sitting on some paper towels right now. I'm currently building a cat tree and my back is killing me. No internet for a good few days. But at least I can still watch YouTube with like data, data, which is fine. I also wasn't able to shower today, so I feel kind of gross. I don't have any like towels here, so I'm feeling a little nasty. I'm very dehydrated. I have to drink more water. I don't even know what my water is. These noodles are pretty good. Mm -hmm. Back to building. Okay, and the cat tree, the cat tree's done. I think it came out pretty good. I'm like, okay, looks pretty cute. Oh, it looks cute. I love it. I hope she likes it too. What is it? <laughs> what is that? What is that? She can't really do too well because of her, her cone. So she's getting a little stuck. Can you all take it off of her? For a bit? Okay. You try? What is all this? <laughs> she got so big. Oh my god. Oh! Hello. 
Hello, hello, hello. It is, what time is it? 8.18 in the morning. So I'm gonna go to Target today and maybe the grocery store. Maybe I'll go to the grocery store later. I'm not entirely sure because I do have to walk up like two flights of stairs. Sorry for the lighting. I do have to walk up two flights of stairs to get to my apartment. I definitely wanna get like some cleaning supplies and stuff. And I have a bunch of things coming from Amazon. The Target is like super close by, but like Whole Foods, like Publixes are like all over cause like Florida, right? There's Publixes, there's like 10 Publixes in like a five mile vicinity of me. Whole Foods is kind of like a 30 minute drive. Maybe it'll be like a once in a while thing. Starting route to Target. <laughs> I thought my towels were gonna arrive on time, but they got a little delayed. This area is like super secluded and nice. So I'm really happy that like, I'm not gonna have the freaking train anymore. That is the most exciting part. Honestly, not having the train is so exciting. Living in the city is great. Like location wise, living in the city is freaking awesome because things are so close to you. So that's definitely like a downside to the move. That's like kind of the only downside that really sticks out is just things aren't like as close. I look so, I look rough. <laughs> Back in the car. I think I'm gonna try to go to Whole Foods. Oh, it's like a 45 minute drive. Wait, do I wanna do that today? Do I wanna do that to myself today? I don't think I do. Let's go to a Publix. This is the closest one to me. This is the closest one. So maybe I should get to know the one that is the closest to me. This one's way bigger. See, this one's way bigger. Let's go to this one. Okay. Eight minute drive. Yes, let's do it. 45 minutes to a Whole Foods. Gosh. That's rough, buddy. That's rough. Starting route to Publix. Yo, it's so like light and bright. Cause I'm so used to like the dark wood and stuff. So let's do a little grocery haul. First thing we've got, shiitake mushrooms. Oh, actually, I lied, I'm a liar. First thing that I got are these mochi cashew cream frozen desserts in the strawberry flavor. Put that back in the freezer. I got bagels. These are the Einstein brother bagels. And I also got cream cheese along with that. I got some grapes. Mm. I also got some strawberries. I got some broccoli. Even though I don't have like my pans and everything yet, they should be coming within a few days. Hopefully this doesn't go bad by then. But I just want to be prepared. So like while I was there, I just picked them up along with some tofu. I got some bread. And along with that, I got peanut. I keep picking up stuff that isn't the jam. Where's the jam? This isn't jam either. Where's the jam? I found the jam. Please focus on me, I have the jam, I promise. Thank you. Peanut butter and jam, this is strawberry jam. I love this one. That's exciting. What the heck is going on with the, has been doing this this whole time? Cause that'll be a problem. I got some seasonings, I got like, I won't go through them all, cause it's kind of boring, but I got like salt, pepper, garlic powder, Italian seasoning, chili powder, paprika. And then I got this tomato sauce, this is spicy Italian, Plum tomato sauce. I got a few of these. These are just the Annie's like mac and cheese in the microwavable cups. And then I got chips. And then I got some pasta. And I got some pasta. I got this whole grain rotini. Fusilli, my bad. My favorite chips, which are these kettle crinkle cut chips in salt and fresh ground pepper. And then I got some Pringles. These are like the wavy Pringles. Ooh, fun. Hello? Oh, this is a spam call. These are fun. They're just regular Pringles, but they got some they got some shape to them, you know? They got some dimension. Yum. I love Pringles. Mm. I gotta really clean this place up because tomorrow she's getting a brother. You're getting a brother tomorrow. You excited? Hope you are. Also, I decided to change the layout of my apartment a little bit, like what I was gonna do. So beforehand, that was gonna be the office and that was gonna be my bedroom, but I'm gonna switch it, I think. I think it'll work better in my favor. Fun. She does not care. She's just hungry. I'll feed you. What? No. No, I will not feed you. I fed you an hour ago. Miss girl. I fed you a hefty portion too. Let's try these bagels. I've actually never had Einstein brother bagels. Cool. They're like glazed over. Okay. They're not bad. I think I actually like the Whole Foods ones more though. I thought my phone was ringing. I hear things sometimes. That's normal, right? 
So, haven't done much. I've been just trying to get a new credit card because my credit card got scammed or whatever and they said it delivered today. It didn't. So I don't have a credit card. They're gonna try to re-deliver it. I asked them to deliver it to my uncle who's gonna send it to me. That's what I've been doing for the past few hours and then also unpackaging everything. I, yes? Okay. I feel like I've been doing so much work and I haven't gotten really much done. But I just ordered Uber Eats because I did not get my pan today. Like I thought I might, I didn't get it. And I need vegetables because all I've had today are Pringles, grapes, and a bagel. So I got some Chinese takeout, sesame tofu, mixed vegetables, rice. <sniffs> Gonna be awesome. Hopefully. I don't know. I've never tried this place before. I guess we'll see. I did bring some of my favorite bowls. So one of them being my cat bowls i brought all of them with me i don't want to really like show you guys too much of the apartment to be honest this is just gonna be you know like my first week being here because i want to do like a full tour especially of like certain rooms i want to do like a bedroom tour like a desk setup type of tour thing i think that'd be so much fun so i don't want to like spoil too much you know you guys have seen this meal before that's good I love when the rice gets like all coated in the sauce. Mm. I have to like stand while eating because I have no chairs. If I sit on the floor, Bummy's gonna try to eat it. So I'm gonna have to stand for like a week because I'm not gonna get my chairs for like a week. <laughs> good morning. Good morning, good morning. I'm sorry if you can hear the washing machine. I'm doing laundry. This new washing machine that I, I hope I'm doing it right. I have about three hours until I have to go pick up the new kitty. And I'm probably gonna try to bring up some more packages. I also have to hire some people to bring furniture up to my apartment because I told Amazon to leave it at my door. I feel like I said this already, but it's just like really bothering me because I spent the last two days just hauling packages up two flights of stairs and my back is like not there anymore. Like I think I just ruined my back. So I need to hire some people to bring the furniture. It's not even furniture, it's just like really heavy boxes up the stairs. We're off to get the new kitty. I showered. I know it doesn't look like I did, but I did. Still haven't washed my hair. We're going as long as we can, okay? I'm really using the excuse that I haven't been going to the gym to not wash my hair, despite basically going to the gym because I've had to haul like 50 pound packages up two flights of stairs multiple times throughout the day and have been sweating my ass off, but it's fine. Okay, let's see. This place is around like 40 minutes away. My Crocs are slipping. Yo, I love Crocs. I just got like my first pair a little while ago and they're all I wear. They're so comfortable. Hi, this is Kyo. Say hello. He's so cute, oh my God. He's a lot louder than Bomi. He's not a fan of the carrier. He's not a fan of the car. He's not a fan. He doesn't like it. I'm so sorry, Boo. Forgive me. This is Kyo. So unfortunately Kyo has some fleas. So I'm keeping him in the closet right now and I'm gonna like thoroughly clean it tomorrow. They gave him a flea treatment that should kill all of them. So, which is like totally fine. The only thing that I'm worried about is Bomi. I can see the fleas on him and they told me they're like, you're gonna see the fleas cause they're dying cause they just gave him treatment. So I'm just gonna keep him in there overnight away from Bomi and hopefully he'll be okay by tomorrow. I'm just, I feel so bad. I hope he's not in like too much pain or anything. Yeah, Bomi seems really curious about him. She's just like staying by the door. Okay, I'm currently editing my video. Hopefully you guys already saw that. And I realize like how frequently I'm wearing the same exact shirts. Everything's packed away right now. I'm waiting for my dresser to get here so I can like start putting clothes away. I could put them in the closet, but my bedroom closet is currently occupied by Kyo. I'm getting a flea comb tomorrow. So I'm going to comb out everything, make sure he has no more fleas, and then I'm gonna give him a bath. But I didn't get to try these yesterday, so I'm gonna try them today. I just had some leftover Chinese. Oh my God, I love it. They're like pink. They like match my shirt. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. I love strawberry ice cream and I really like it like this. I, I've never had strawberry mochi, at least in my memory, but I really like it like this. This is so good. Mm. 
Okay, they're eating next to each other. That's a step. Omi is quite a bit bigger than him. Um, she is only like 10 days older than him, but she's quite a bit bigger. You guys can see. <laughs> I look great. Fake it till you make it. Okay, grocery haul. I just got back from Whole Foods. It uh, started storming like really bad though, so that was kind of spooky. First thing I got was three bagels. I got an everything bagel and two sesame seed bagels. I got some cut up strawberries, two containers of cut up strawberries. I got some muesli. I got some apricots, apricots. Got three containers of shiitake mushrooms. And I also got a container of baby bella mushrooms. I like to have these with like pasta. I got some cashews. Cashews are my favorite nut ketchup. I got three containers of this cat food that they've never tried before, but I'm gonna see if they like it. It's this wellness pate brand. I have this one. This is the chicken. This is the tuna. And this is turkey and salmon. I got two chocolate chip cookies, not chocolate chip, sorry. Double chocolate cookies. I wanted to get chocolate chip, they didn't have any. I got some Beyond Meat hot Italian sausages, Beyond Meat meatballs. I got some ravioli. This is Kite Hill mushroom ravioli and spinach. I also got two containers of this tortellini. Oat milk ice cream, the vanilla bean flavor, and the oatmeal cookie flavor. These are my favorite. Three bottles of my chocolate banana. I say my. Like, this is my brand. Um, just the chocolate banana koya drink. This is just like one of my favorite drinks. I got a bunch of Via Life cheeses. I got two jars of mother-in-law's kimchi. I got some Just Egg, some Sweet Earth. Benevolent bacon and then more Kite Hill cream cheese. Hopefully we can fill this up more in the future. I haven't been vlogging all that much. Uh, my two friends came over and they helped me carry up some packages. They helped me carry up this desk that I'm currently assembling right now. And then I hired some junk removal people to get rid of all the cardboard boxes. So now I can actually walk throughout my apartment. And now I'm just kind of assembling some things. My camera's broken, which is great. But yeah, I'm just assembling this desk. I'm sorry, I've been vlogging all that much. Not that you guys care. It's just been, um, it's been a lot. It's been stressful. Oh my god, why are you acting like a star of you? Let me walk! Excuse me! Y'all are insane. Y'all are freaking insane. Okay, updates. Hey, this video is so bad and I truly apologize. Let me give you some updates. So number one, I'm cooking. Go me. I just received my new credit card. That's a good thing. Let's start off on a bit of a better note. Got my new credit card because my old one got, I guess, scammed or whatever or stolen or whatever. So I had to get a new credit card for that, which was a whole headache. I haven't had really a credit card for the past like week. And the furniture that I thought I was gonna get today uh, did not come today. It's actually gonna take maybe one to two more weeks. Because in my purchase, I got a dresser that apparently got put on pre-sale or like it's not ready. So they held my entire order, which I wish they would have just told me saying like, hey, the dresser isn't ready. Why don't we split it up and like, we'll send you this part of your order and then we'll send the dresser like later. But no, they withheld my entire order. So that was an entire freaking headache, which is just so ridiculous because the furniture I bought is like really expensive furniture. And I was just like really appalled with how everything's working out. Like, I don't know with the amount of money I spent, I expected it to be here like, I don't know. Maybe that's just me being really stupid and pretentious and annoying. I'm sorry. And then now my cats know how to jump on the freaking counter. No. Oh my God. So 
Yeah, I don't have a mattress, I don't have a bed, I don't have a couch, I don't have anything. I don't have anything. And then once again, the packages I asked, like the fireplace that I got, I got a fireplace and I also ordered a desk. Who knows what's gonna happen there. Um, I asked them to be delivered to my door and they're never delivered to my door. So I either have to spend more money hiring someone to get it up two flights of stairs or have to break my back to get it up myself, which is like pretty impossible. Like me carrying up, I don't know, like anywhere between a 75 to 150 pound thing up two flights of stairs by myself. Not really, what? I just fed you. <laughs> it's just not really ideal. I'm not doing good, guys. I'm really not doing good. I have cried five times today, which will add to the maybe like 50 breakdowns I've had in the past like three to four days. And it's just been really bad. My back is already killing me with the mixture of like sleeping on the floor and then like hauling things up the stairs. I don't know. I hear that sleeping on your back is supposed to be, I mean, sleeping on the floor is supposed to be better for your back, but clearly, that's not working out for me, probably because I'm also hauling 50 to 150 pound things up the stairs. And I just, I, but ending on a positive note, Bomi and Kyo are getting along great. Here are some pictures of them getting along really well. So, and also my camera's broken. I think I mentioned that. My camera's broken. So I have to spend more money to buy a new camera. Talking about this makes me want to cry all over again. And this probably is like such a first world problem. And people are like, oh my God, girl, like imagine complaining about this. And it's like, I know, I know. For these to be my problems, I'm very blessed. I get it. But when all of this happens, like, like dominoes all at once, and I'm, I'm just doing all of this by myself, it's just a lot. And I feel like nothing's working out. I just feel like nothing's working out and it's just really overwhelming. So this video sucks and I'm really sorry. I don't even know if I'm gonna upload this. The water is boiling. I'm gonna cook my pasta. All right, so I have, um, this is like my makeshift band-aid because I sliced my finger this morning and I guess it was pretty deep because it just won't stop cleaning. <laughs> so I have some pasta with Beyond Meatballs and then some steamed broccoli. I was this close to ordering out again, but I didn't. I cooked, my stools came, and these are super comfy. Bomi, oh my God. At least I can sit and eat now. That's a plus, that's good. She's so curious. Do you see this one? There's this one over here, right over here. He's watching. <laughs> I'm sure she's happy she doesn't have to wear the cone anymore. That's exciting. No, no. This isn't real meat. You don't want this. You don't want this, I'm telling you. Bomi, this is literally all carbs. You don't want this. <laughs> Whoa! Crazy girl. And before you go, if you haven't already heard today, you are amazing, you are beautiful, you are wonderful. You are so valid, and I am so, so happy that you are alive. I love you so, so much, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!